Hi friends, welcome to my channel friends. This is finger abacus multiplication class 2 and we are learning how we can do multiplication of big numbers in fingers within seconds. But before that, please like, share and subscribe my channel and press the bell icon for latest updates. And friends, if you want your kids to learn abacus and do multiple number calculation in mind within seconds or you want your kids to learn coding and become a game developer in their early childhood age, then book a free demo class in our institute ever academy. The phone number is displayed on the screen. So now let us start the class. Friends, in last class we have discussed method 1 of multiplication and today we will discuss method 2. Okay, in method 1, we do first 1's place calculation and then 10's place calculation. That means from right to left. And in method 2, first we do 10's place calculation and then 1's place calculation. That means from left to right. Okay, if you, you are teaching your kids these multiplication methods, then you should follow method 1. Why? Because in school, they are learning the same method. They are calculating first 1's place number and then 10's place number. So, if you will tell them to calculate first 10's place and then 1's place, then they will get confused. Because school, they are learning different method for the same thing. And at home, in finger abacus multiplication, they are learning a different method. So, if your kid is small, then there is a chance that they will get confused. So, you should use method 1. But for, uh, for us, method 2 is great. Why? Because in this method, you don't have to reverse. What happens in method 1? First, we have to calculate 1's place, then 10's place. And at the time of saying answer, you have to say first 10's place number and then 1's place. But in method 2, you have to calculate 10's place number first and then 1's place. And at the time of giving answers also, you have to speak 10's place number first and then 1's place number. So, it is more easy than method 1. But your kid is if learning a multiplication, then you should follow method 1 because they will get confused. Okay? So, now let us try these three questions both in method 1 and method 2. In method 1, okay? 3 of 3 is a 9. In 1's place we will represent 9. 3 3 is a 9. In 10's place we will represent 9. Then while speaking answer we have to speak 10's place first and then 1's place. 99. Next. 3 1's are 3. 3 2's are 6. While speaking first 10's place and then 1's place. 63. Next. First, at the time of calculation, first 1's place, then 10's place. 2 2's are 4, four 2 4's are 8. While speaking the answer, first 10's place and then 1's place. 84. Okay? Now discuss method 2. 3 3's are 9. 3 3's are 9. 99. Okay? 3 2's are 6. First 10's place. 3 1's are 3. Then 1's place and while speaking also... Same. 63. Next. 2 first tens place and then 1's place. 2 fours are 8. Then 1's place. 2 twos are 4. While speaking also same. First tens place and then 1's place. 84. Okay. Now let us discuss small friend formula. Friends, in our multiplication course, there are two formulas. The first one is small friend formula and the other one is big friend formula. Small friend is number 5 and big friend is number 10. And if we need numbers below 5 like 1, 2, 3, 4. Then we have to use small friend formula. And the number 6, 7, 8, 9. We have to use big friend formula. First we will discuss small friend formula then big friend formula. But why we need a formula? Let us discuss this first. For example, let us take an example for that. The question is 16 into 4. Okay. So first 4 ones are 4. First in tens place. Then 4 6 are 24. Right. So we have to represent 20 here and 4 here. So 4 we can easily do. But for 20 we don't have fingers. If you will open this it will be 5. So in this case we need a formula. Because we don't have beads to add 2. 
So plus 2's formula is minus 3 plus 5. So close 3 fingers and open the thumb because thumb is 5. So the answer is 64. Understood? One more example. 17 into 3. 3 ones are 3. 7, 3 sevens are 21. Now we have to add 20 here and 1 here. 1 we can easily add. But 20, for 20 we don't have fingers. If we will open this, it will be 1. And if we will open this, it will be 5. So again we don't have fingers. So we will take the help of small friend. So for plus 20, we will use plus 2's formula. Minus 3 plus 5. Close 3 fingers for minus 3. And open thumb for plus 5. Answer is 51. Understood? Okay friends, now our regular practice questions, let us first understand then practice. 11 into 9, 9 ones are 9, 9 ones are 9, 99, understood? Next, 8 ones are 8, first tens place calculation, then ones place calculation. 8 to the 16, 8 to the 16, now 1 here and 6 here, 1, 6, 16. Now calculate 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 90, 5, 6, 96. Understood? Next. 13 into 7. 7 ones are 7. 7 threes are 21. Now 20 here and 1 here. 20 and 1. Now calculate 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 91. 91 is the answer. Next. 14 into 6. 6 ones are 6, 6 fours are 24. Now 20 here and 4 here. 20 and 4. Now calculate 50, 60, 70, 80, 80. 4 is the answer. Next, 15 into 5. 5 ones are 5, 5 fives are 25. 20 here and 5 here. 20, 5. Now calculate 50, 60, 70, 75 is the answer. Okay friend, I am sure that you have understood the concept. Now let us call our mastermind Kritika. You also do with her and see whether you have understood the method or not. So let us call our mastermind Kritika. Kritika please come. Hi. Are you ready Kritika? Yes. I'm Friends, ready. you are ready? Okay. 16 into 4. 4 into 4. 4 is 24. Answer is 64. Very good. Next 17 into 3. 3 into 3. 3. 7 3 ja, 21. Answer is 51. Very good. 11 into 9. 9 into 9. 9 into 9. Answer is 99. 12 into 8. 8 into 8. 8 into 16. Answer is 96. Very good. Next 13 into 7. 7 into 7. 7 3 ja, 21. Answer is 91. Very good. Next 14 into 6. 6 into 6. 6 into 24. Answer is 84. Very good. Next 15 into 5. 5 and the 5, 5 5 the 25, answer is 75. Very good, good job Kritika. Bye. Friends, if you have really liked the video, then don't forget to like, share and subscribe. See you in the next class. Bye-bye.